SFRC online. We're looking at uh, live oak, Quercus virginiana, perhaps the classic of all of our southern hardwood and oak trees. It's uh, most distinguishing from other hardwoods in the south because of this massive trunk that it will develop and then the low crown of the long spreading decumbent branches that roll out away from it. It's easy to tell from some of the other uh, oaks and hardwoods because of this deeply furrowed bark. It gets deep fissures and it's kind of gnarly but it's uh, very easy to tell, especially as it gets darker and black in color. These trees were very useful in the uh, 1600s to 1800s as an important part of making the wooden ships that were part of our naval fleet. They would cut these notches out of the branches and use those as major segments as they built the hull and the decks of the boat. Branches also have uh, all these epiphytes and ferns that will often grow on them in the shade. And today, that's the major purpose of this tree is as a landscaping and a tree for yards and landscaping where it has especially high value, but very little other commercial value other than firewood. Let's look more closely at some other characteristics. All oak trees have leaves that are alternately arranged on the branch and they are simple leaves. In the case of the live oak, that they are very persistent leaves until at least March of the following year. They have a dark green upper leaf surface and a very lighter color green on the lower surface which helps distinguish them from some of the other oaks like laurel oak. The margins are smooth and sometimes they wrap around just a small amount. The fruits are, that are produced are acorns that are very black when they mature. They're about three quarters to an inch long and they're covered over about a half of the length by the involucre or caps on them. 